Hey everybody, it's May 26th, 2022. If I look a little bit worse for wear, it's because I just finished grading for my classes for the semester. <sighs> Spring 2022 was a weird one. You, however, are in the future, like eight months into the future. I'm planning to upload this either on my wedding day or close, like a little bit after the wedding day because today I'm unboxing my wedding gown. So if a month ago, I was going to say a few months ago, about a month ago, I tried three dresses from Azazi, and you will have probably already seen that try-on video, because right now I haven't edited it because I've been busy with ending the semester and all of that, but I tried three dresses. Uh, I'm only planning to picture two of those dresses, though, because the third one is the one you're going to see today. This is the Aria dress, and... I ordered it in custom sizing because with samples I ordered it in a zero and it was way too big and also way too long. I'm about 5'2", so most standard wedding dresses I would have to cut off about like 10 to 12 inches of fabric. So I love that Azazi offers this custom sizing option. So I have it right here. I did film yesterday when it first came in the mail or delivered by OnTrack, so it was much more nicely put into this whole box here when it arrived. I don't know how they fit it into this small of a box, but they did very neatly. All right, Evie, do you want to see? <laughs> Starts grooming herself. Sorry, honey. large dresses in her hiding spot. And I have inspected it just to make sure it was the right dress and the right color and all of that, but I have not yet tried it on. So let's take it out of the garment bag real quick. And I'm filming this really quick while my fiance is getting lunch, so hopefully he doesn't come home in the middle of it. Um, yeah, I'll show it to you and then we will try it on and I'm really hoping the custom sizing works. I did have my fiance measure me for it, so it's helpful to have somebody else to measure you just to make sure you get accurate measurements, especially for your height and things like that. But yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and try it on. Or actually, no, I'm going to unbox it fully out of the garment bag for you and then we will try it on. Right, my cat is sitting just below me and I have learned in the last month that she's terrified of wedding gowns because they're large and poofy and make noise and could engulf her. So she's right under the bed underneath me, which is really funny. When I took this out of the package yesterday, uh, she was scared. So this is the garment bag in all its glory. They do send you a free garment bag once you buy a dress and these uh, are how the sample dresses come as well. So let's open her up and see. So, this is going to be interesting to film on camera. I have had it hanging by the, um, what do you call it? What are these called? The hangers? The straps? Not the actual dress straps. Just to not stretch out the actual straps of the dress. I think I'm just going to take it off the hanger for the purposes of this video, though. It's a lot less fabric than the sample because the sample was not made for my height. So this is going to be a little bit different, but this is the Aria in diamond white and champagne. And I opted for the diamond white champagne because the diamond white on diamond white was a little bright for my liking. And I'm actually good, glad I made that decision because we just did our engagement photos. 
and my photographer has a very bright style, so I think the champagne is going to look a little better in photos, at least for my taste. So there she is. And then the back has this beautiful lace floral detail. And one thing I noticed that is a little bit different about the actual dress versus the sample is on the sample, these buttons on the back were nude colored. And on this one, they're bright white or the diamond white. So yeah, and then there's a sample or an extra button, I guess, in case one falls off. The buttons aren't actually functional on this dress, which is fine. Uh, they're just decorative. So yeah, it's a lot shorter than the sample because I'm a lot shorter than sample dresses. <laughs> So yeah, it's a little wrinkled, but that's to be expected. Uh, I'm either gonna get a steamer or borrow a steamer from my fiance. I think he has one already. Should we try her on? <laughs> Wedding dress. I'm gonna film one more clip for good measure because I'm not sure that I showed it very well in the last clip. So pretty. I love the florals. Okay, so it's not too small, but it might be too big still, which is a better problem to have. I think up here I'm going to have to get the, um, the straps shortened. And then the length is still a bit long in the front. So I might have to get it hemmed just a tad or decide to wear heels. I wasn't planning on wearing heels. But it might, just because it is a little long. But otherwise it fits good, at least it's not too small. <laughs> because that would be bad if it was too small. But yeah, up here, I think, I think the straps need to be shortened or something at the back. Hopefully that can be fixed. But otherwise I'm happy with it. It's pretty, it's still pretty. <laughs> okay. I know they do give you a $75 alterations reimbursement, hopefully. So I might take them up on that just to get some of this a little bit more worked out. But otherwise I'm happy with it, which is, which is good because I was a little worried. I just have to make a few more adjustments with the fit. But yeah, that's it. It's starting to get a little warm so because it's late May. So I switched out into my regular clothes, but yeah, that is my dress. Gonna have to make probably a few adjustments to the sleeves here and maybe get it a little bit more shortened if I'm still gonna wear flats. But yes, that, that's my dress, that's my ring. I think they go together really nicely. But yeah, that's my Azazi dress. I'm really happy with it. Would totally recommend. Even if the custom sizing is a little bit off, I think, like we're still starting from a much better fit than a standard size. So I'm really happy with it. And I hope everybody else is too. I was just getting ready to put this away and I noticed there's like a loop here on the back. Is this supposed to be, it seems too low to be a, is this a hand loop or is this a bustle loop? I'm not sure what's going on here, but I appreciate it. I'm just not sure what it's supposed to be. I feel very weird right now. <laughs> I just had my bridal hair and makeup trial and 
the person I hired is super nice and super great at what she does. I just feel so weird wearing more makeup than I've ever worn in my life. So I'm getting used to this, but I think what I'm going to do is try my dress on, wrap up this dress unboxing with a real ending. It's seven months later, by the way, from when I actually got my dress. Um, but I've got the dress altered to my body at this point. I've got my hair and makeup on. We might as well put the two together, right? But I'm just an Ako Taco. Um, who still says that? What is this, 2011 Tumblr? I'm just awkward, and I feel awkward. So I feel like putting on the dress will make me feel less awkward about my face right now. I like it, like I'm warming up to it. It just feels so foreign to me. So let's put on a fancy dress and see what happens. See if my confidence goes up. <laughs> Here she is. So feeling kind of awkward, but less awkward, I guess, with like my outfit actually matching how I look right now. <laughs> Hi. All right, this is me. I'm gonna go ahead and close off this dress unboxing here. Look forward to more things relating to the wedding, I guess. I actually forget what's coming after this one. Accessories. I think accessories is next. So look forward to that. All right. I'm going to put my dress away before I ruin it in my house. All right. Take care. Bye. I just realized I had that last clip super zoomed in, but I'm going to go ahead and close off the dress unboxing portion of this here. Um, I did spend a good deal of money getting this dress fitted, um, but I did also get the alterations credit for $75 after all, so that came through, so that was nice. Um, yeah, I'm really happy with my dress. Just wanted to try it on with the hair and makeup just to see what the effect was. But yeah, that is going to do it for this, whatever this was. I hope it was fun for you. I'll talk to you later. Bye.